The SMEs say the open market's toilets are not in working condition due to a lack of water supply. Thus, they bemoaned is not good for business and poses a health risk. Namibia Industrial Development Agency manages the open markets. Like uh, now, all our toilets are closed. Even the office of the government is closed, this one, this of Trader, with nothing to do. People also have a salon here, they are supposed to use the water. It's very effective, too much. We don't know how we can solve this problem now. And for now, we are just suffering of water. Even our customers, they want to use the toilet, it's a problem. Once you, once you ask you the toilet, it's a problem. They are also afraid to tell her what is happening to the toilet. The SMEs claim that NITA management was tied up about the lack of water supply to the open market and appeal that it be restored. NBC News approached the Kirtmanswood Municipality CEO for comment. My understanding is that the pipe burst occurred after the water meter. So that is the responsibility of the owner. So NIDA should look at their pipes, repair the pipes, and um, then we can open the tap for them. Since October last year, water supplied in homes a community market was disconnected due to default payments according to Pusson. And this is what NIDA spokesperson Vessel Nanusep had to say about the water crisis. All the tenants are aware that they should pay for water and electricity, uh, but it would appear that that responsibility has been shifted to the landlord, which is NIDA. That is an unfortunate situation and it's causing uh, problems for the tenants as well as the agency because of outstanding uh, bills to the service providers like the municipalities and town council across the country. He urged the tenants to pay water and electricity as well as rental fees. Nanusep noted that NITA is aware of the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic on SMEs. Luke Mantluta, NBC News, Kietpanswap.